Good evening, folks. Well, the Florida Gators hosted an SEC opponent for homecoming. The Gators brought in the Auburn Tigers to Ben Hill Griffith Stadium on Saturday. WDHN's Robert Smith was there, and he recaps the contest. Florida Gators brought in an unusual opponent for homecoming, the Auburn Tigers. The Tigers haven't visited the Swamp in 13 years. So Saturday evening, the Tigers wanted to make a mark, but struggled to do so. Within two minutes of the first quarter, Kyle Trask and the Gators struck the board first with a 64-yard touchdown. The Gators limited the Tigers to just two field goals in the first quarter. Auburn's first touchdown didn't come until the earlier part of the second quarter, and after that, the execution was at its lowest. But the defense held their own, especially Derrick Brown. Oh, man, we had a lot of turnovers, which was good, man. We played, we played good, and Derrick Brown, you know, he played a really good game. The game went south for the Auburn Tigers when Bo Nix threw an interception during a drive of momentum with 30 seconds left in the third quarter, followed by a huge run for 88 yards by LaMichael P. Ryan to seal the game. This loss was a big one for the Tigers, and it was also their first one. Gus Malzahn says the crowd played a huge factor today. Oh, very disappointed. Um, you know, they're a good team. Uh, the environment, uh, you know, the crowd did get to us. Uh, it really kind of surprised me. I don't know how many false starts we had, but we had a couple short, um, you know, short yardage deals. We got backed up. Uh, we had trouble here in the flat um, for the cadence and then sometimes had um, slow communication as opposed to the play. And, um, but stuff like that happens. I mean, every team that walks into the swamp, they have communication issues, uh, but we just didn't. Um, do anything uh, for those to make up for it. In Gainesville, Robert Smith, WDHN.